So I think this has been out a couple of weeks. It's a limited edition jalapeno Philadelphia cheese spread. Now, jalapeno, you can see there. Jalapenos, hot chilies. We all have a bit of jalapeno on pizza and things like that. I'm not a massive fan of things overly hot. I do like hot spicy food, but it doesn't like me. So we'll see how hot this is now. You'll see that the packet's open because I've got a cracker down here ready to eat. You can see the bits of jalapeno in there. And it really has got that distinctive, that's a lovely smell, that distinctive jalapeno flavour. And that's not just green flecks, that's actual little pieces of jalapeno. Although the ratio isn't great. But then I suppose if they put too much in, it would overpower it, wouldn't it? Uh, eat within one medium fat soft cheese, jalapeno, chilli pepper, and green bell pepper. So it's got normal peppers in it, as well as jalapeno. Do you know, once I know somebody made a cheesecake. Have I said this on a video before? Somebody made a cheesecake and used garlic and herb Philadelphia instead of normal uh, soft cream cheese. So the cheesecake didn't come out right. Anyway, I'm waffling. Here is said product on a cracker. I've put a little bit on. Look how thick I've spread it on. But you've got to get full maximum taste. Is it hot? Yes. My mouth, it's not burning up in an horrible way. Jalapeno does have a really nice smell and a really nice flavor. And you can tell that's got jalapeno in it. I said that the ratio didn't look particularly high because otherwise it would overpower it. And that's why they've done it. It's strong enough with just a little bit in it. I'm just gonna look at the ingredients at the uh, ingredients, cheese, jalapeno, pepper is 5%. 5% of that is jalapeno, and that's all that it needs, to be honest. And that hotness has calmed down now. It's calmed down, I've got a lovely aftertaste. For me, personally, I think that's really nice, and that's really, really gonna be Moorish and addictive. So Philadelphia jalapeno gets a thumbs up from me. And it's limited edition, which means it'll only be in the shop for about two and a half years, probably. We'll probably review it again in two and a half years, thinking it's limited edition, we forgot we've done it. Anyway, I'll see you next time.